there guys, it's Brogues here, back with another Far Cry 5 video. In this video I'll be discussing this week's live event, Root Canal, and telling you the best way in which you can complete it. Now firstly, this week's live event involves melee killing 10 peggies and then recovering their teeth. Now there are two consumables which are going to make this a lot, lot easier to do. The first is the fast. That's going to increase the speed at which you can cover ground and take down those peggies. And... The Furious, that will massively increase your melee damage, allowing you to one-hit kill any enemy you come up against. Now, as per usual, all you want to do is go to an outpost that you know that you haven't already taken over. You've taken over all of them, just go back into the outpost master, reset them, and then go in and cause havoc. <laughs> Remember, in order to complete this week's live event, you will have to loot the corpses and collect their teeth. Doing so will reward you with this week's unique weapon, which is Tooth and Nail, which, surprise surprise, is a melee weapon. Basically what it is is a baseball bat with teeth embedded in it. Now, the stats for this are actually identical to a weapon already in the game. That weapon is the Spike Bat, and as you can see, the even look similar. This new weapon is essentially just a reskin. Now, this weapon does look slightly different. You can actually see the teeth embedded in the baseball bat, but it has no unique attributes or abilities. Now, for this week's live event, I'm going to give it an F rate. It's a failure. Basically, firstly, it's far too quick and far too easy to complete. 10 kills, like even melee kills aren't that difficult to get. Secondly, the reward, it's just not rewarding, it's just a reskin of a baseball bat, there's nothing unique about it, it's not bringing anything into the game. Uh, thirdly, there's no replayability, if you've completed the game, you are not logging back in to do this event for any reason. Lastly, there's there's better options available to Ubisoft, like some sort of outpost master where you have to go in with, say, a limited weapon set, like get, take over an outpost without being spotted using only a bow, something like that, with increased difficulty, and the more times you complete it, the more skins you get for the new weapon or new item or new vehicle or whatever. Something like that would be genuinely challenging and would actually be rewarding to play. Now, that's my thoughts on this week's live event. If you've got any thoughts yourself, please feel free to comment down below. If you thought this video was at all informative or helpful, please feel free to drop us a like or indeed subscribe to the channel. 